All right, you guys, so it's been a minute since I've been in the kitchen, but with the fish we caught the other day, if you guys haven't seen that video, I'm gonna link it somewhere around here so you guys can check it out. Um, wanted to make one of my favorite meals and want to walk you guys through it in case you guys wanna try it out, so let's go. All right, first thing we're doing is just cutting a couple tomato slices with our pig knife. You guys don't have a pig knife in the kitchen, you're missing out, man. So, a couple small thin slices. Get yourself some romaine lettuce, pick off a couple leaves. Pretty good. Give it a good rinse. All right, so now we're gonna make a dredging station. I'm gonna show you guys how to bread these fillets up. All right, if you guys have never dredged anything before, you're gonna learn today. A little bit of flour. Crack you an egg. All right, don't forget to beat it like it stole something. All right, next what you wanna put in the other bowl is your uh, your breading. In this case, I'm using Everglades, uh, the pre-season all-purpose breader. Love this stuff. If you guys haven't tried it, give it a shot. So instead of depending on the breading to give it a little bit of flavor, what you wanna do is put some seasoning inside of the flour. In this case, we're using Everglades heat. I told you guys I love this stuff. If you guys have been here on the channel long enough, you've known I use this thing for almost everything. So just kind of put some there in the flour. Don't be afraid. And just mix it up. All right, so we're gonna use tartar sauce to dress the uh, the fish sandwiches, but if you like meat and you like spicy, my suggestion is take some tartar sauce, get your favorite buffalo sauce to give it some kick. Give it a good mix. And you got yourself a nice spicy sauce to dress your sandwich with. Don't judge me for eating tater tots. If you don't like them, you're the problem. So while the fish is cooking, I got some buns here that I cut in half, buttered them up. And what you want to do is kind of heat them up on the pan right there. Don't forget to have your little apple juice while you're waiting. Hot, 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 hot. <laughs> Alright, so that's the color you guys want to see on this, a nice golden brown, so let's get some of these out of here. Put on a paper towel, let it 
suck up the excess oil. And as soon as you're done getting all these out of here, we can build. Alright, so we're gonna get our spicy sauce, put some on the bun, spread it out, both sides because we're not cheap around here. Right, we take one of our fillets, put it right there, take some of our lettuce and tomato, ready to eat. You guys are gonna take a quick bite. Mm. <laughs> All right, you guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to try the recipe. You're not gonna regret it. I, I guarantee you, you're not gonna regret it. And um, don't need the potato tots out, because that's the best part. <laughs> Later, guys. <laughs>